Good morning, guys. I guess I won't be able to give a garden tour today, but there's my sunflowers. Look how tall they're getting. Good morning, guys. I'm about to go out. It's my day off, and I have a bunch of errands that I have to run. I don't really want to go outside in uh, this rain, but I kind of have to. So if you if you see someone silly wearing ABC Boys hat and furry Uggs, that would be me out in the pouring, storming rain. <laughs> I'll be sneezing too, sorry about that. Oh man, the garden is loving it though. Just wait till the sun comes out, it always does this. It pours and pours and then when the sun comes out, man, everything takes off like crazy. Hey guys, I'm in Savers and I thought I'd try on this dress. I was looking at it actually a few days ago and then I saw this, it had this tiny little hole in it. Like, it's so tiny, but I'm thinking maybe I could fix it because I've really liked it a lot. I don't know, it kind of reminded me of I don't know, Mexico or something. <laughs> I don't know, but I'm hoping that maybe I can fix this if I end up getting it. Because they'll give me 25% off on it, so we'll see. I don't know. What do you think? I felt like it was a good length. Like, it's not too short, but it's not like too long, and it's not too like dressy looking. It's like a really casual kind of dress. We're in Costco. What are we getting? Lemonade? Taxes. No. <laughs> uh, we're getting lemonade okay. and gloves so you can spray paint. Okay. Spray you know, adhesive. I, I didn't know how much you use those disposable gloves till we got them. I, I know. Like, I use them for everything. The paint, these glue, garden with them. I haven't seen anything new come in on the beauty aisle in Costco lately. Jenna Hip, Egyptian Magic. Have you guys ever tried that? Does it really work? Pink Sugar fragrance. I have one of those. I love it. Look at that. Good price. Wait a second. Is that cheaper than before? 20 bucks, what? I swear it was like 28 in here before. Wow, that is a good price. That's almost tempting. How can we don't get this? You get it for a gift. Oh no, I don't need nail polish. Uh oh, I'm just throwing stuff down. Oh. That was a setup. <laughs> there, I'm putting them upside down. Look at this color right here, eggplant. What do you call it? Eggplant. Michael calls the color of the year eggplant. Dragon it's fruit. No, it's not dragon no? fruit. <laughs> I would I would make one dragon fruit, but it's orchid. Orchid. It's Just a radiant it. orchid. Oh, I see. Okay, we got lemonade, gloves, a coffee, a latte freeze. Only a dollar fifty for these. Well, dollar forty-five but plus tax. So good. Oh God, that's not our truck. I don't know where ours is. <laughs> There, we're over here. We're back here. <laughs> I know you offered to get me my own, but uh oh, what are I, they doing? What? Is, I don't know what's going on. Texting. <laughs> I'm supposed to go to the fabric part, but really? I guess I can do that when I come back out to, to get the pegboard. Okay. But that was on my list. Uh, we're running errands this morning. All right, we're at Habitat for Humanities the Wee Store, one of my favorite yeah. thrift stores, but. Like for furniture and stuff too. We come in here so much. Kind well, we're best friends. To the restore. <laughs> what are you looking for today? Pegboard. 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 I've got one big piece oh. right over there. Okay. Yours right. for only ten dollars. Yeah. Nice. Very nicely yeah. made. What's the price? Five dollars. Five Comes with a bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> ah, looks like a good quality piece. Maybe made in India or something, huh? Show me the price. Okay, so we, we've seen this one for a little while here. It was $13.50. It's now been reduced to $9.50. Look how beautiful it is. Shabby chic, even. Nice. Oh, Ooh. wow. Yeah. yeah, that's a good quality piece. Looks like it came from a furniture store or something, huh? Yeah. This is actually where I get a lot of my hardware and knobs and stuff for DIY projects. So I'm going to look at some holes. They got in here. And if someone had asked me if if I did projects just to do them for videos or or what exactly. And I do projects. Well, my channel is kind of you know about sharing ideas about all kinds of stuff, whether it be makeup or you know DIY projects or whatever decor. You know. So yeah, I mean I don't just do projects just for myself. I do because I like doing them, but I also like sharing ideas and information with you guys. Um, so, yeah. What is this one? Uh, hmm. 
And don't forget, you can also paint on hardware. So like, say you come across a piece and you're like, oh man, I really wish that was white or I wish that was silver or something. You can spray paint it. Put a sealer on it afterwards, a sealant, and you're good to go. All right, that was a quick peek at Habitat for Humanity's The Restore. We love going in there. So now I've got to go to the post office. Michael decided that he likes the dress. Yeah, the Mex the Mexican well, dress. I almost went into the changing room with you there to help, <laughs> Stop help it. you get out of it. <laughs> I did. So anyway, I didn't get it yet though because I have to go home and sign up to become a Sabres Club member because I guess I wasn't yet. I just have a little card that they stamp like when you spend five dollars they give you a stamp. So uh, I couldn't sign up in the store because I guess they only let you do that on certain days. So uh, if I want to get the dress for 40% off I gotta go home and do it and then print out the email which I don't have my printer set up yet so it's like this, oh. this whole, <laughs> whole thing of me trying to get this dress. but. I think it'll work out just fine because I gotta go out again anyways. I have a lot of errands to get done today. Oh, it's open. Oh, good. It is open. At least one of them is. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to St. Anthony's Thrift Store. Okay, this side's open. Is this side gonna be open too? I haven't been in this one for a long time. Every time I come, it's closed. All right, we're gonna check out this side first then. Okay, I didn't see anything on that side, so let me try this side. Usually I'm in this side anyways, and tend to find fun things. I can't seem to keep it together. I'm just angry. Yes, it's, it's, it's tomorrow already. Did you find anything you like? Uh, no, anything in there? No, not really. Oh, okay, let's Hey guys, I'm home and don't mind the mess here. We are working on some things. So I have to measure this frame. Look at this. I found this at the St. Anthony's thrift store um, like a couple of weeks ago and I have some plans for it. It's a little bit dirty and dusty and beat up, but I think it's gonna turn out really neat. So we're gonna be doing a makeover on this. But what I gotta do first is, look at that, made in Mexico. So let's see, I need to measure the back here because I got some plans. So let me measure this out and then we have to go out, run a few more errands and go to Lowe's. It's Taguma. Bruising. <laughs> He's a legend on Maui. So we just got our pig board cut. Pig board. <laughs> now I'm on my way to the hardware section. Looking for little mini eyelets. Eyelet screws, see what I can find. A lot of times when I start these projects, I really have no idea what I'm doing or exactly what I'm looking for. I just kind of browse around until I find something that I think is gonna work. Look, $1.24. Are those the cutest? tiniest little guinea pig screw eyes you've ever seen. Look at that. They call them screw eyes. I don't know. That just sounds weird. I was calling them like screw eyelets or something. I don't know. Alright guys, so I just got home with my new dress from Savers. Well, new old dress. And I'm going to go ahead and see if I can use this unique stitch to, uh, to stitch together that hole basically. So let's get that tag off there. So this cost me $8.00. It was 40% off, uh, originally 13. Okay, so I'm just gonna take a look at the directions here because you know, that's always good. Although I tend to just kind of like go for stuff. I don't really do much reading, <laughs> but I suppose I should using a new product that I've never tried before. Squeeze directly from tube onto back of fabric. Smooth adhesive with finger or small brush. Washes off finger easily. If hemming or positioning, and no, I'm not. Okay, use gentle finger pressure to position applique. No, okay, here we go. So I'm gonna turn the dress inside out. You guys are gonna get to experience this with me. First time using this stuff. Alrighty, there it is. There it is. Should I put something under this? Maybe, 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 maybe. Here, let me just use this just in case so I don't get anything on top of my dresser. But we did seal my dresser, by the way, because clearly I tend to throw things all over on top of it, so it's a good thing. I'm just gonna see kind of what the texture is like. It's sort of a little like Elmer's glue is what it looks like. Okay, just get a tiny bit out there. I just want those kind of loose pieces, the loose threads, to just kind of seal up right next to their little friends. 
Okay, so it looks like that bonded well. So it says to not wash until after 24 hours after bonding. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the dress alone and get to work on this, but I'm not gonna show you guys. I'm gonna go out and spray paint this right now, tape it off, but I'm not gonna show you guys in this video because that's gonna be its own video. But uh, that is the plan for right now. Look what Michael made for lunch, tacos, yes. I know I get lots of questions about um, like, why don't I do vlogs, like food vlogs? I don't know, I just kind of thought that maybe you guys would get bored after a while because we don't really change up what we eat too often. Um, I mean, I can tell you that we eat as much Mexican food as possible, uh, you know, throughout the week. So several times a week we do tacos for lunch. The roses I sprayed last night because those uh, Japanese beetles. Oh, right. Yeah, we found out what was eating the roses. We've got Japanese beetles pretty bad. Michael caught them. Late night. In the act. Yeah. Oh gosh, look at your gourd. Oh my goodness, look at this. I got three of them. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Those things are getting huge. Our basil and tomato. Let's see, where's our tomatoes? Here we go. There we go, see them in there. Yeah, they're coming along. How tall is that? Uh, it's gotta be over nine feet now, for sure. And then over here, oh, hello. Look at that, where's the butterfly here a minute ago? There's a bee. There's a quick little update on the garden, and I know someone had asked, I think, at least Michael had mentioned that someone asked about planting by the road. Well, this is actually a very small driveway that we're on. I don't know, it's not, not like traveled heavily or anything. And the main road is actually out a ways from us. What is this? We're at the farmer's market. What are these? Roots. Chico's, wait, she usually has a note on what they are. Star, Star apple. apple. Yeah, Steve, uh, someone was telling me about these. We have, we've had these. We have? Yeah, I get some though. They're good. Yeah, it tastes like a milkshake. Yeah. yeah, going off in here today, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Broccoli mushroom stir fry with garlic and teriyaki. Mm -hmm. Uh, bok choy. And then that's it. So we just went to Savers, and I can never film in there because they play music, and it's it's too loud for me to try to get away with filming, because, um, you know, YouTube doesn't allow music even if it's just in the background. Um, so I picked up this little mirror that was 99 cents, made in the USA, handmade in the USA. So I'm going to be doing a project with that, and I got this little thing, which is, you know, thrift store junk, me and my thrift store junk, <laughs> basically. But it's a little storage container and it's got this really ornate silver top and I think I can buff it so it'll be really nice and shiny and new again. That'll be fun. What about the little guinea pig stairs? The guinea pig stairs they wouldn't let me have. There was like this, you know, just those like plastic stairs. Um, they're like, I don't know, spice sort of rack sort of thing, you know, you just set stuff on them, but it's like tiered stairs and you like set them on on top of a counter or something and they like slide, like one piece slides out from the other so it's like extendable and you can adjust the size, like how wide it is. They put two price tags, one on each side, even though it was like, you know, put together and it's like one piece, but they were going to charge me double and I was like, no, I'm sorry, sir, no can. How does that make you feel? It, it upsets me. <laughs> <laughs> Michael was like, I got out of the store and I was like, how rude is that that they put two price tags and it's originally sold as one item and it's just a piece of plastic and they're going to charge like almost $8 for it. I would have gotten it for $3.99 but not $8, I'm sorry. Alright, it's Saturday morning at 5.48. We're on our way to work. Swap meet. Hey guys, 
sorry I didn't film while we were working. It was, well, it's not that it was busy. It was just like, <laughs> uh, kind of like rain in the morning and then, you know, it just gets kind of hectic when you're working. All right, now we are off to lunch because I'm starving. So we're gonna go with our friend Tom to Fernando's Mexican food. Chimichanga, chips, guacamole, sour cream, pico de gallo, salsa, onions, jalapenos, onions. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Sabrosa. 